Hey everyone, welcome back to another Terraria video, but this video is very special because we're going to be joining Team Trees and we're going to be planting a bunch of trees in this Terraria world. And mainly we're choosing this Terraria world because, you know, I've been using this world for a long time for a majority of the videos that have been on this channel in the past couple of months. And I've noticed when you look around on the map, there's a very big lack of trees in certain areas because, you know, they've just vanished over time to make room for videos. And, you know, making my little own spin on Team Trees, we're going to be planting trees of course in terraria but yeah there should be definitely over 100 i don't know it really depends how much we can cram into certain areas but yeah make sure you guys go to teamtrees.org and donate because one dollar equals one tree and that can make a big difference especially nowadays let's go ahead let's get to planning so we're gonna start here at my spawn as you see when i teleport this is where i go because this is our spawn of the map so i'm gonna press control on my keyboard now the reason why i'm pressing control is you can see the little the little yellow placement box right there and this thing does auto placement for trees it makes sure that the trees are the right distance apart so i'm gonna place one right here as you see it auto place the next one there and then it's gonna auto place one there one there one there look at that so we're getting a lot of trees i'm gonna try and not place them over you know obviously previous built structures just so you know we can still see everything and uh we got this fertilizer right here from the thorium mod it instantly grows a sapling to adulthood let's go ahead let's use this on these trees boom 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 bam how to change it up at the end with a bam but look at that that's six trees already uh this one doesn't look like the healthiest tree but you know maybe it'll grow into something beautiful let's keep on going though our next spot is over here let's go ahead boom oh i accidentally placed a bunch right there but there you go there's another tree and let's head over here you know let's fill out this whole snow biome first let's fill out the whole snow biome you know christmas time is coming the winter is here might as well do the uh, snow biome the beautiful snow biome which is a very underrated biome in terraria but but it's not its fault honestly i think this biome probably has more love than the desert uh, just because you know this biome has its own themed loop which is very nice you like to see it let's go ahead let's keep on planting some trees this may not be the most entertaining video but you know we are we're putting the entertainment aside for once and we're putting something that really matters the most and that is our earth our environment you know your boy is definitely gonna have to drop a couple bucks on the teamtrees.org website so we can get some more trees growing man just think about it a dollar equals a tree like honestly i might fill up this water right here just so we can plant more trees i'll be 100 percent honest i lost count of how many trees we planted already it's all good i guess but there we go that's five more boom get these babies sprouted i don't think that's the right terminology for trees but there you go that's a good bit of trees right there i filled up a bunch of holes that have water in them and uh, obviously this there was a big hole right here and now look nice flat area for six more trees but as we move over here you know we start to see something we start to see something the day is getting darker and it's because there's a lot of crimson over here and we can see the crimson as a sort of pollution for our real world so maybe i have to get rid of this crimson completely and get rid of the pollution in our world so thanks to some mods you know we have these barrels here that make our contaminator spread and shoot more so let's go ahead let's put these on so we're gonna take our contaminator and our green solution and we are gonna get rid of this pollution slash crimson that has taken over our world. Now this stuff that I'm shooting right now with all these attachments equipped, this stuff is straight up going all the way down. So you can see, look, it's getting rid of the crimson that's down there. So let's go ahead, let's do that some more. Boom. The crimson won't exactly be fully gone. There might be like a little patch here and there, but we got rid of a bunch of it. And uh, hopefully, you know, if I spray it all over the world, we can get rid of even more of it. But for now, that should be good. We can continue our tree initiative. Sadly, there's no such thing as stone trees. So we're probably gonna just skip over this whole stone area. And uh, this area is very patchy, but this was part of a video. So, you know, I'm not gonna patch up this area. But, you know, we still got a lot of saplings we can grow. Kind of weird how they're just growing on like one or two blocks or two or three blocks here. But, you know, if a tree can still grow, then a tree can still grow. I don't have a problem with it. And boom, that's another one. How many more areas can we place over here? I think it might be getting slim. Maybe we can flatten this a little bit and probably sneak a tree in. Yes, there we go. And then if we break this rock, we could probably sneak one in. Boom. And maybe if we flatten that, we can sneak one more. No. When do we take that? Yes, we can get one more. Nice. Boom. Boom. Bam. And I think that's all of our snow biome now covered with a lot more trees. You see a lot more trees. Beautiful. I can... I can already breathe the fresh air. All right, so I have flattened out the area a little bit in this forest biome. So let's go ahead, let's start planting some. Can we get some underneath here at all? Or is it too low? I don't know. I swear I've seen people grow trees before. Maybe they need to be revealed to the sun. I don't know, but uh, that seems like that's all we're gonna get here. Let's go ahead, let's start fertilizing these babies. 
and you know get a little bit more fresh air oh it won't let me grow this one it won't let me grow this one do i have to move this a little bit there you go yeah i had to move it a block and we should be good now boom boom some more the rest of them should be good i don't know why that one did that you know usually the uh, smart cursor which is when you press control and your cursor becomes fat uh that usually knows where to place everything not gonna place anything here no this is from the firework video we did but uh as we come over here we get a little bit more spots to place some and uh you know any area that has <clears throat> either a lot of water in it or just has like some open space that's not exactly flat but i can fill up and make flat we're gonna do it because you know that might help out and that gives more rooms to plant some trees boom there's like three saplings i just placed with that fast click i just did and it's looking good see this area right here we can flatten this area out a little bit more and we can get a nice and open area to plant some more trees but these npcs are obviously in the way excuse me the trees are more important than y'all get the hell out of here all right so there we go we flattened the area we may have to sacrifice one tree but that one tree turned into five more so boom get these babies up and going nice fresh air coming from them now we get over here and as you can see the smart mouse or the smart cursor won't let me plant anything over here it let me plant over here and one of the trees did already grow but look yeah it's letting me plant over here but it's not letting me plant here but look at this if we plant one and then grow it it does work so i don't know what's happening i'm gonna try my best here to space them out the perfect amount so we get maximum treeage is that a word treeage but yeah we're gonna try our best that one grew into the npc olympics racing area which uh you know this kind of doing this video is kind of just like going through the memories of this old world we'll, we'll do an official video where i go through like all the stuff that happened in this world but you know we're still using it for some videos so that that's yet to come that is yet to come but look at this oh my god bro donita get out of the way i knew there was a sapling behind her she was trying to hide it i know she's trying to get some of this fresh air but we gotta we gotta grow them out first hold up we probably can get one right here we probably can get one right here baby i don't know yeah look at that definitely get one right here boom and then up here to our next area we got a lot of open area to work with here and uh you know let's go ahead let's just plant a bunch of these we gotta watch out for these rocks these rocks sometimes block uh space for trees or saplings so we gotta watch out for some of those but there you go a bunch of more trees the world is starting to get more and more beautiful and uh, you're starting to notice like all the empty patches everywhere they're getting filled with trees they're getting filled with trees we got a lot more empty patches on this side so let's get to it you know i might have to do like a montage or something of filling out certain areas i might, I might do that soon because uh there's only so much i can talk about when we're talking about trees and stuff so we are entering the desert biome here in terraria and the desert biome normally does not grow any trees instead they grow a very similar thing to trees kind of cactuses as you can see but i don't think there's a way you could actually grow cactuses in terraria there's no mod that adds in the growth of cactus i don't think not yet that is or not that i know of but you can indeed grow something else and that something else is palm trees and these trees are beautiful so we're gonna grow as many as we can here in this desert biome and uh we might come into a couple other biomes where it might be hard to grow certain trees just because you know maybe you can't exactly plant the saplings for trees in that biome but uh you, i don't know we'll we'll see what happens oh we're coming up to a biome that we may not be able to plant saplings in but look at this this is a biome from the calamity mod and it has beautiful things in here wait a minute does the fertilizer work though no look see the fertilizer is not working you can't just plant the little stubs i don't know if that does anything or if this is a decoration or what but I, I don't know i've never seen a tree in this biome i'll try and space out these saplings a little bit and then we can come back and see if they've grown at all i doubt it because this biome does not exactly look the friendliest when it comes to growth in nature but they got cactuses here so you know you never know you never know so we are entering a hollow desert biome pretty cool looking it's not something you see too often it's not something where you see palm trees too often as you can see they look a lot cooler they got a really cool theme to them and let's go ahead and sprout all these same thing with the cactuses but this hollowed biome goes from normal hollow biome to a painted hollow biome real quick now maybe like game raiders what the heck is a painted hollow biome it's just a hollow biome that i should have painted with a mod and as you can see the paint starts getting a little bit crazy you no know, it does have a little bit of a, an effect here and there like it's turning these hollowed cactuses into regular cactuses because i'm assuming you can't paint over hollowed cactuses without them changing back to normal ones but yeah this area i'm not gonna flatten too much because it's another kind of historical area no there was a very fun video recorded here and i don't want to mess up the area too much but we will grow the trees here and there maybe honestly i should probably you know hit some of these trees with some 
paint and see what happens and we just got a little bit more and we will be out of this painted hollow biome into a painted normal biome another area where i won't fill in the holes and gaps too much just to keep the memory strong you know keep this how it was maybe we can fill up this water i don't know because it's not going to be painted as randomly as this is painted but i'm not seeing anything with the smart cursor we may move on unless there's an area down here we can plant something what about over here we got we got one little sapling right here boom that one little sapling can change the world it can change the world and everything is still painted when will we leave the painted area i don't know it looks beautiful though don't get me wrong all right here we go we are getting out of the painted area and honestly i could probably flatten this out a little bit you know i think from this point on unless we run into something interesting or something or an obstacle we have to overcome you know i think i should just put this in montage mode so let's get planting some damn trees All right, so we are finishing up this left side of our world by planting these last couple of trees. And we kind of run into this obstacle over here. Not really an obstacle, just an area where we're not gonna be able to plant a tree just because, you know, this is an area that doesn't really have trees, this calamity biome. So uh, we're gonna start moving on to the right side of the world. But there we go, that, that was the last set of trees on the left side of our world. And it looks a lot more beautiful. As you can see, a lot more tan sticks sticking out of the floor on the map. They're beautiful trees, they're giving more air to our terraria world and All right, after all those montages put together, you know, we covered some distance. We covered a good amount of distance and it, we're here at the jungle. Now, the jungle does, in my opinion, have some of the coolest looking trees in the game. And you know, in the future update, aka 1.4, which is pretty much the final like big content update, there's supposed to be like bamboo trees or something like that. And that, that's pretty dope because the bamboo furniture and all that, that stuff looks cool. Once 1.4 comes out, you know, I might have to make my house out of some bamboo. But yeah, let's go ahead, let's run through the jungle now the jungle has a lot of this like stuff where the trees are in water now the problem is you can't actually plant saplings underwater so i'm assuming how the terrain generation does it is it plants all the trees and then it just sprinkles a bunch of water everywhere in the jungle and that's the way those trees get in the water like that but uh let's go ahead you know fertilize any tree saplings that we see i got a good bit planted around i don't even think i did the whole jungle yeah i just did a good bit of it and uh here we are we're entering another area a lot of water in this area jesus maybe i should cover this up right here and we might be able to get a couple trees going right here and uh, i guess i'll see you guys once we reach this beach over here all right we are here with our final tree that we could plant in the world and it is this one right here let's go ahead and fertilize it boom and there we go we have planted 
definitely over 100 trees like i said i lost count once we got to like 10 but as you can see the world a lot more filled with trees than before i don't really have an exact before and after like i said but you know things are looking a lot better and the air is fresher i don't know why i keep saying that like i can actually smell the air through a video game but yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video make sure to check out teamtrees.org link will be in the description one dollar equals one tree and that one tree can help out a lot especially in today's world where you know we gotta be more conservative about things but yeah i will see y'all in the next video make sure to follow my twitch my twitter join my discord and check out my second youtube channel where i post my full twitch live streams bye bye